countless times shorter durations of genetics research, more accurate medical diagnostics, complex processes modeled in nanoseconds. This is only a small part of the possibilities provided by a powerful supercomputer operating in the Vilnius University Information Technology Research Center. It comes with 2,000 processor cores, double that of gigabytes of RAM. If all the memory of a usual computer was filled only with movies, and if we watched one movie a day, we would finish watching them all within one or two years. It's interesting to note that supercomputer memory could accommodate the number of movies, watching of which would require more than 500 years. Our supercomputer can be used for theoretical scientific research and adapted in various fields aeronautics, space exploration, chemistry, biochemistry, or even medicine. In other words, its capacity is limited only by the scientist's imagination. The cloud computing solutions were adapted in our supercomputer. They enable us to access the serving services through a browser to start a virtual machine and to use all required resources remotely. We enter the main page, from here we access all resources, log in, develop new machines with a click of only a few buttons. By using the available resources, the scientists, researchers and students can shorten the duration of necessary computations significantly and obtain the significantly more accurate results. We encourage the students to work with our supercomputer. Any student from Faculty of Mathematics and Informatics can log in and use the supercomputer resources. The scientists who attempt to find a new scientific field or research direction instead of being involved in formal projects can do so without any restrictions. Users from other institutions, especially solvers of applied problems, are also welcomed. Currently, we have some users from the Institute of Theoretical Physics and Astronomy, the Faculty of Medicine. The range of services provided by the center is wide. It offers not only high-performance technical resources, but also the potential of highly qualified scientists. Here, science and business come together. A part of the time of supercomputer use is dedicated for international projects and projects of commercial organizations. For example, currently we're implementing the project with a Belgian capital company. We're developing a specialized storage system for patients' ambulatory cards data. The system will allow each person to access his health history and data of medical examinations on his mobile device. Another interesting international project implemented by the scientists of the center is the tool for sentiment analysis. It will allow identifying various emotions, in other words, love, anger, hate in the text, and will help to assess comments and public statements in cyberspace, social networks, and online portals. The project is implemented together with scientists from Ireland, Great Britain, Italy, and Latvia. The aim is to identify what texts can be offensive, promoting racial or religious hate. We also work with child lines, since the developed program allows early identification of potential suicidal cases. If this system helps to save at least one life, our work will be really valuable. Emergence of new high-performance computing resources in Lithuania provided the possibility to perform world-level research and experimental development works for science and business. Therefore, the scientists from Vilnius University Information Technology Research Center encouraged the innovative business to use the scientific technical potential of academic environment while developing and implementing the advanced scientific solutions in manufacturing and business.